This project depends on the open source FFMPG software. So this is just a primer, small introduction to the FFMPG and how to obtain it. So that is the objective of this tutorial. And let's see how to obtain FFMPG and get it working. You can start by searching FFMPG in your search engine and click on this ORG link. If everything goes right, you will be able to open this page ffmpg.org and on this page you will get introduction to a big software. This is an open source software. This software is used by is an inspiration for most of the video converters, audio converters and most of the audio processing, video processing software that you find in the uh, multimedia industry. We will be using a very small subset in which we will be extracting audio out of a video file. So in this case, your first step would be to click on this download. So when you click on this download, you will see download source code because this is an open source software, you will get the source code also. But compiling this source code is a very tough task and requires a heavy expertise. So for this, they have provided us a few already compiled installations and we will be interested in this part. Since this is a project targeting Windows platform, we'll click on this Windows icon and when you click here, you will see Windows EXE files. There are two options, gyan.dev and this one second one. I'll go by this one, click on this one and let it open. When you open it, it says Codeplex FFMPG and binaries for Windows. This signals that we are at the right point and let us go down and down. We should be able to see various builds of this software and one of the builds that I am using is from the FFMPG JIT, JIT hub. So this is the uh, place where I will be getting my software and I will click it here. When I open it, this GitHub page opens and these pages since are on GitHub, they are essentially safe to download. And in this case, you will see three or four options and more options rather for source code also. But we are interested in this uh, .zip file. This is about 80 MB. We should download this file and we should get it working. So if we click here, our download will start and we will get this essential underscore build. This download will be available to us in our downloads folder. It will be something like this as you are seeing here and we can double click it to open it and go to the bin directory. You will see three software FFMPG play and probe. The software of our interest in this tutorial in this project would be FFMPG. You should extract this FFMPG to some safe place and from there we shall be using it in our next tutorials. This is how you can obtain FFMPG and I'll close it right now. Thank you.